the return to school when there's an, uh, another Omicron wave, another COVID wave, uh, and this time with Omicron, um, it's really concerning to be so close to people with so many people in that school when um, people are dying in the hospital, when the hospital is full and the government hasn't done um, anything to really prepare teachers and educators to be prepared for this return to school to be safe. I would like to see an option for people to be allowed to go to home if they prefer that, if they feel safer at home. I know some people, their mental health is really affected by um, by going um, online. And I understand that. But for me, um, safety comes first. And if people, um, but if other people, it's the opposite, then they are welcome to go at school. But I would feel more, more safer at home. And I would like to have uh, more distancing and more sanitization prepared. From the students I've talked to, many of them want to be in schools, but they want to feel safe. I have immunocompromised household members um, and family, and I want to protect them, and I don't want school to be the reason that I can't. So I, I feel, at least from what we have heard from the government, which is not a lot, that teachers aren't getting the proper resources to have safe classrooms. And we felt that we weren't in a safe area, that if we went back to school, we were scared that um, teachers would get sick and that even then teacher resources, like, like teachers themselves, there wouldn't be enough teachers to teach the students. Um, all in all, there's just a lack of resources that we were told we were going to be provided for schools um, that don't really tend to be um, given.